Good morning, greetings, friends. Welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado, registered pharmacist number 12275. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality, to your well-being, and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body, you are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That is why we are here every day, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 27 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity, skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle. But what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure because the human biological system is a healing system, a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing, renewing, regenerating system a miracle, it really is no miracle. It's just the way the body works. If you have questions about health and nutrition or prescription drugs, we want to hear from you on the Bright Side. Our number is 855-660-4261-855. 660-4261. Try to get on board early. The phone lines fill up quickly. And invariably, we do not get to, uh, inevitably, we do not get to all our callers. So try to get on board early at 855-660-4261 so we can get it. Uh, help as many folks as we can. If you want to learn more about the longevity products that you hear us talk about on the Bright Side, if you want to purchase any of the longevity products that you hear advertised or recommended on the Bright Side, you can head over to brightsideben.com. Take a look at our shopping cart. With all the longevity products and all the longevity systems, the Healthy Start Pack is up there. And, of course, you'll find the Beyond Tangy Tangerine up, my personal favorite longevity product. Beyond Tangy Tangerine 2.0 now is available with even more value. The Beyond Tangy Tangerine is liquid nutrition, just the way your body likes it. It allows you to get a nice, sustained, slow release of nutrients. You sip on it all day long. keeps you from snacking. Most folks will notice that they lose weight. Most folks will notice they can reduce their dosages on their prescription drugs. Some folks get off their prescription drugs entirely. It's 50 bucks a canister, give it a shot. And if you want to make some money selling longevity products, selling the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, you can click on the Join the Team link, start yourself a business, and enjoy all the tax benefits associated with having your own business. You can click on the Join the Team link, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470, 866-735-2470. All right, thanks for joining us once again on the Bright Side. We're talking pimples. We're talking acne, we're talking zits, and we're talking vitamin A. Vitamin A, vitamin alpha, vitamin anabolic, the main building vitamin, not even really a vitamin at all, more akin to a hormone in the sense that it has a communication role. Hormones help cells talk to each other. Hormones command cells to do things. Remember we always say all disease is cell disease. Well, in many ways, vitamin A, because of its role as a commanding molecule and a, a general molecule in the sense that it's a general, like an, a general in an army. It orders cells to do things. If all disease is cell disease, and vitamin A plays a key, key role in almost all health issues. All disease is cell disease. Vitamin A is critical for the functioning of a cell, and that means vitamin A is going to have a role in almost all pathologies, all, cell, all diseases, all breakdowns in the body, especially in acne, because the skin is growing really fast. Anytime cells are dividing really fast, anytime tissue is growing really fast, it's going to be using nutrients and it's going to be using these hormone-like substances very fast as well. Vitamin A is used up real quickly by the digestive system and by the skin, the two fastest moving tissues in the body. That means, folks, digestive issues, think vitamin A, and skin issues, think vitamin A as well, including zits, including pimples, including acne. Here's the deal, though. We don't really know, most of us anyway, don't really know what a pimple is. How the heck are we supposed to deal with skin, uh, with acne skin, with pimple skin, with blemished skin, if we don't even know what a zit is? I did a random uh, informal survey with some of my friends last weekend to see if anyone could tell me exactly what a pimple was and how a, a pimple was formed, and not a single one, I must have talked to seven or eight people, not a single person could tell me exactly what a pimple is. Of course, all of us are dealing with these things. 80% plus Americans get breakouts at one time or another in their lives. 
Now, you may be sitting there thinking, who cares what a pimple or a blemish is? I just want them off my face. I don't care about how they're made. I don't care how they're formed. I don't care what they are. I just want to get rid of them. And that, my friends, is the problem in a nutshell with how we address our health challenges, whatever they may be. If we remain ignorant about our acne or arthritis or atherosclerosis, if we remain ignorant about how these diseases and pathologies and breakdowns show up, we will be suckers for every formula and every potion and every nostrum that we see or that's advertised. And you better believe marketers love our ignorance. This, in a nutshell, is why we have a, a trillion-dollar predatory healthcare industry, and we're sicker than ever before. It's not pimples; it's principles. It's not about our, it's not about our pimples. It's about the principle that we have to know how our bodies work. It is fundamental to the healing process. Otherwise, we will be suckers for every prescription and every potion and every nonsensical medical strategy that's out there. And that's what's happening. That's why we have such a. Uh, that's why the healthcare system has failed us so egregiously. It's because we are ignorant, ignorant about how our bodies work. A pimple is really nothing more than a combination of poor and follicle-lining skin cells growing out of control. And as they're growing out of control, they're secreting fats and proteins out of control as well. And to compound matters, cortisol, your body's stress hormone, will increase the secretion of these fats and these proteins, and so will insulin. Both cortisol and insulin play a key role in the formation of pimples. Cortisol is your stress hormone, insulin your sugar metabolizing hormone. That's why it's so important to watch your intake of insulin spiking foods if you have acne or if you have comedones. That's why it's so important to work on the stress system of the body, not just emotional stress, not just mental stress, but also physiologic stress if you're dealing with acne or you're dealing with zits. This combination of cells growing out of control and secreting fats and secreting proteins out of control creates this sticky mass inside a pore, inside a follicle. Remember, the follicle is like a rabbit hole. Inside this rabbit hole, you get a mass of, of, of oils, of protein, of cells that are dividing rapidly. As these oils become abundant, as they accumulate inside this rabbit hole, they become rancid. Literally, the skin oils, the oils that are produced out of skin cells become rancid as they're reacting with oxygen. Then they can become black. We call those blackheads. Blackheads are nothing more than, than oils that are accumulating in this rabbit hole follicle and becoming oxidized. If they're not affected by oxygen, usually because they have a little microscopic thin layer of cells on the top, then they're called whiteheads. Now, whiteheads and blackheads, they're unpleasant enough. But remember, the skin is home to many, many millions, hundreds of millions of bacteria per square inch, and this is where things get really ugly. Whiteheads and blackheads, they're just cells and oils that are accumulating in this rabbit hole. But once bacteria that live on the skin become involved, then you really got a problem. These bacteria that live on the skin can become trapped inside the rabbit hole. So you've got this rabbit hole-like follicle. Cells are dividing rapidly, usually because of nutritional deficiencies. Cortisol and insulin can be involved as well. Oils are being secreted out of some of these cells. Now you have a mass of cells and oil plugging up this rabbit hole follicle. And now, if you have bacterial involvement, bacteria become trapped in this little follicle. You got oils, you got protein, you got a trapped follicle, a bacteria trapped in the follicle, and now you got uh, 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 all you can eat bacterial feast. Bacteria can eat this, the, the dead cells, they can eat the protein, they can eat the oils, and then they go nuts. These bacteria, by the way, are sensitive to light and oxygen, so when they're trapped in the plug, they can proliferate. And they got plenty of food. So they got food, they got privacy, and they go crazy. And that's where you really get into trouble. In the darkness, in this oxygen-free environment of an acne, of a plugged follicle, all that protein, all that fatty food results in a proliferation, uh, a growth of bacteria. These bacteria munch out on the fats and the protein and the oils. They release gases. And in this combination of oils and dead cells and, and uh, of bacteria in ever-growing numbers uh, activate the body, the skin's immune system. Them, and that's where acne begins. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll continue this discussion when we come back from our break. Are you
Our number, 855-660-426. A little over a year ago, I began to do a lot of research into why, even though I had a pretty good-sized meal, that I was still starving. And my research led me to a well-known fact that most of the soils that we grow our crops on here in the United States and across the industrialized world are almost completely depleted of almost all of the key minerals and trace elements that our bodies need to rebuild themselves, fight off cancer, and be healthy. I then searched out the best vitamin and mineral company out there and discovered Longevity. The Longevity products are designed to give you the real nutrition you need, and once you've got that, you don't have to eat as much to be satisfied. I've lost 37 pounds in two months simply getting the vitamins and minerals I need. Check it out for yourself. It's incredible. Go to InfoWarsTeam.com today and order your first canister of Beyond Tangy Tangerine Complete Multivitamin Mineral Complex Dietary Supplement. That's InfoWarsTeam.com. Dwayne Daly from Midas Resources, August 5th, 2013. Gold open today at 1308.65. One ounce gold coin can be purchased for 1342.98. A half ounce for 671.94. And a quarter ounce for 335.75. That's 1342.98, 671.94, and 335.75. Hi, this is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? Wait a sec. Gold and silver is going up while Congress is trying to settle on the next debt increase. And there's no end to this madness. That old 401k and IRA can be converted into physical gold without tax consequences. I explain this in my book, 10 Reasons to Buy Gold. Don't let time slip away. Call for your free copy today, 800-686-2237. Get away from that Washington spin and get honest answers about gold. 800-686-2237. The book is free, 800-686-2237. People are taking charge of their lives with healthier lifestyles. That's why you have to experience the Raleigh Durham Gluten and Allergen Free Wellness Event. One day only, Saturday, August 17th from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the Durham Convention Center in Durham, North Carolina. Explore the Gluten and Allergen Free Wellness Event where learning is fun and delicious. Discover the world of gluten free with free samples, cooking demonstrations, and lectures with well known members of the gluten free community. Enter the raffle and you could win the grand prize of a catered barbecue from Bone Sucking Sauce valued at $3,000. The Raleigh Durham Gluten and Allergen Free Wellness Event August 17th at the Durham Convention Center. For more, visit R-A-L-E-I-G-H glutenfreeexpo.blogspot.com Raleigh glutenfreeexpo.blogspot.com Presented by Udy's Gluten Free Glutino, Enjoy Life Foods and Longevity. For over five years, you've been hearing about the Berkey guy, so you may know a few things about him. For example, you are well aware of the superior quality and effectiveness of Berkey water filters and accessories. But did you know the Berkeys have had independent lab tests done to prove just how effective they are? It's true, and he can email you the test results. Just visit GoBerkey.com. You may also know that the Berkey guy has helped tens of thousands of people get better prepared. Now here's something you may not know. GoBerkey.com has amazing specials and deals all the time on a wide variety of survival and preparedness products. Most ready to ship same day. Visit the Berkey guy at GoBerkey.com and be sure to click the red Products on Sale Now button. You can always call toll-free 877-886-3653. Again, that's 877-886-3653. GoBerkey.com, home of the Berkey guy. America's number one source for independent talk radio for over a decade. We are the GCN Radio Network. Back on the bright side, I'm Pharmacist Ben. Thanks for joining us. We're here Monday through Friday, 8 to 9 Pacific, and 10 to 11 Central Time, 24 7 on the archive page at brightsideben.com. You'll find a shopping cart up there with all the Longevity products, including the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, if you want to purchase any of the Longevity products, or if you want to join the Brightside Ben team, click on the Join the Team link at brightsideben.com or call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866 735 2470. Our number today on the bright side, 855-660-4261. Try to get on board early if you can. 
and we'll get as many calls as we can uh, get in uh, here at the bottom of the hour. We're talking about the formation of a pimple. I don't want to get too I don't want to get into too much detail, but it's just so important to understand because if we don't really understand how these things form, how these how these things start, we become victims of marketers and of, uh, of people selling us products, of dermatologists, of the medical model. And it's just not fair, and we can't blame them. That's what they do. We've got to blame ourselves for our ignorance. So understanding how disease shows up, understanding how the body breaks down, and understanding in terms of the skin how these things form, zits form, how eczema starts, how psoriasis starts, is so, so important if we're really going to begin to address our health and to exploit and leverage our God-given ability to heal and regenerate. So a zit is formed when cells start to divide like crazy inside a follicle. A follicle is like a little rabbit hole in the skin. You've got millions of them around the, all over the body. Sometimes they'll have hair coming out of them. That's called a hair follicle. In any case, these cells are divide rapidly. Oils are secreted. If you just have oils and cells, you get a little plug. That's called a whitehead or a blackhead. If bacteria become involved, then you really have a problem because bacteria activate the body's defense system, the body's immune system. The skin has a built-in defense system. We talk about how the digestive system is the body's most important site of immunity. But it's important to recognize that there is tremendous immune activity on the skin as well. The skin, after all, is a major interface between the body and the environment. The skin literally has cells that function as scouts. This is so cool. Immune cell scouts. These cells are constantly scouting the skin. They're scouring the skin. They're searching the skin. As well as the digestive system in the blood, you have scout cells in the digestive system, you have scout cells in the blood, you have scout cells pretty much in the entire body, but on the skin you've got these scout cells, and they're looking around, they're searching for bacterial invasions. It's kind of like the skin is this strange science fiction universe filled with bizarre creatures and high-tech uh, chemical defense systems. So in any case, once the immune cells, these scout cells, spot an invasion, they spot the bacterial proliferation and growth, these scout cells send out a red alert chemical message to soldier cells, the soldier cells of the immune system. These soldier cells live in the blood. And these soldier cells, they also live in the lymph. They live in the blood and the lymph. These soldier cells get uh, uh, the scout cells send a command signal to the soldier cells. The soldier cells uh, migrate to the area where you have this bacterial proliferation where you have this plug, these soldier cells are then released from the blood. The blood vessels will open up, expand, and these soldier cells will leave the blood. This is so cool. The soldier cells leave the blood, and they come to that uh, follicle, that plugged follicle, where you have that bacteria. And by the way, this is what accounts for the redness and the inflammation that's associated with the zit as the, as the uh, blood vessels and as the lymph is opening up to release the soldier cells. You get this uh, manifestation of inflammation. You get the manifestation of redness. These soldier cells are shipped off to the, to the follicle, to the site of attack. It's like a microscopic version of the Normandy invasion. If you ever watch those old World War II documentaries on the History Channel, you probably saw the D-Day invasion. Basically, hundreds of thousands of soldiers were packed up in ships and boats and uh, eventually in these little sardine amphibious, sardine can-like amphibious uh, assault vehicles, and they're dropped off on the beach in Normandy in a major military event. is called Doomsday or D-Day. Well, the skin and the immune system and the lymph have their own version of doomsday, of D-Day, where the bacteria or the Nazis and the Axis powers, the allied soldiers are the white blood cells, the ocean is the lymph and the blood. And as these white blood cells approach the site of the bacterial proliferation, the blood vessels and the lymphs are expanding so that the soldiers can leak out. They're like the, it's like the amphibious assault vehicles open up and the soldiers leak out into the, into the uh, 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 follicle where you got the bacteria and you get this attack. I think this whole thing sounds like a big mess. You're absolutely correct. From a microscopic version, a zit is a big mess. The expanding blood vessels is, uh, account for the redness and the swelling and the white blood cells killing off the bacteria and their high-tech chemical weapons produce what is called pus. So what does this whole thing have to do with vitamin A? What does this whole bacterial and immune system mess have to do with vitamin A? Well, it turns out a lot. Remember, this whole process that winds up in bacterial proliferation and inflammation and immune activation and pus begins with out-of-control growing skin cells and their production of fats and proteins, and vitamin A is the key player, capital T, folks. It's the key player in how cells grow and divide and differentiate. 
And because growing cells are secreting oils and proteins as they grow and as they morph and as they differentiate, vitamin A also plays a key role in the production of skin cell proteins. This is true, by the way, of vitamin A inside the body, in the blood and in the skin. And using vitamin A can be very helpful internally to addressing the formation of acne pimples. In the book, uh, The Vitamin Nutrient Solution, Dr. Robert Atkins talks about using a daily dose of 200,000 to 500,000 IU of vitamin A for a period of three to four months. Now, I personally consider that to be somewhat high, and even Dr. Atkins suggests in the book that uh, a physician monitor anybody taking that much vitamin A, but certainly you could take 20,000 IU easily, 30,000 IU easily. It's not going to cause you any harm, and given vitamin A's very important role in stabilizing the growth of skin cells, you can notice healing and prevent uh, healing uh, properties and preventing pimples with just 20 or 30,000 IU a day. But what makes vitamin A such an important tool for addressing acne is the fact that not only can you get benefits by using vitamin A supplements, not only can you get anti-acne benefits when you take vitamin A internally, but you can get some really important benefits by using it topically as well. And this is so important. In fact, you can't, you can't watch TV for half an hour without seeing a commercial for that dumbass product that I'm not going to tell you what the name of it is because you all know it starts with a P, where you got the kids, they got all broken out skin, and then they wash their face with this product, and all of a sudden their acne disappears. Well, let me tell you something, folks. That product, which contains the active ingredient benzoyl peroxide, one of the more toxic things you can ever put on your skin, by the way, can't even come close to the power, the effectiveness, and the non-toxicity of topical vitamin A for dealing with acne. Now, you can, get, you can get benefits by using vitamin A supplements. Make no mistake about it. But when you swallow a vitamin A supplement, it's got to get processed through the digestive system. It's got to go through the liver. By the time that vitamin A that you're taking orally in a supplement or through food, by the time that vitamin A gets to the skin, it's going to have to be processed, stored in the liver, and then it's going to have to be delivered to the bone and the digestive tract and the heart and all these other areas of the body. Every cell in the body uses vitamin A, so your 20,000 or 30,000 IU dose of vitamin A is going to wind up in your eyes and bones and muscles and brain and every other system of the body in addition to the skin. In fact, the skin will probably be the last place that your uh, vitamin A gets delivered to because to the body, the skin is not as important as the more internal organs. Your body could care less about your zits, and it's going to be distributing, distributing most of the vitamin A that you take in supplements or in foods to the more critical areas like the brain and the heart and the liver. By the time the remaining vitamin A gets to the skin, there's not going to be a lot left, and that's why topical vitamin A, especially in the form of retinoic acid, can be so, so important for dealing with pimples and dealing with zits. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. We're coming back with more good health information. 855-660-4261 is our number. We'll be- Hi there. My name is Frank Bates. What I'm about to tell you in the next 60 seconds could get me in a lot of trouble. I just created a free video presentation at 123coverup.com that exposes the electricity monopolies and government agencies for what they really are, incompetent, lying crooks that are counting on your ignorance and fear to keep your power bills criminally high. Some have called this a conspiracy. Others have called it a cover-up, and you will be shocked to find out how deep the conspiracy goes. My video at 123coverup.com exposes the truth and shows you the secret of how I beat them and how you can beat them too. Watch the controversial video that thousands of other smart patriots have already seen in the last three months. Go to 123coverup.com and discover one weird trick to slash your power bill and protect your home. Go watch my video now at 123coverup.com before they force me to shut it down. Again, that's 123coverup.com. If you owe the IRS back taxes, listen carefully. Sweeping changes to IRS policies will help more people than ever eliminate their tax debts once and for all. And now I can help you reduce or eliminate your tax debts and end your tax nightmare. Hi, I'm Dan Pilla. I've helped thousands of people reduce and eliminate tax debts they couldn't pay. And after more than 30 years of experience dealing with the IRS, I can tell you there's no such thing as a hopeless tax case. And with the IRS's new policies, it's easier than ever to put your tax debt behind you once and for all. Call now at 800-346-6829 to learn how I can help you. You know your IRS debt will not go away by itself, but you don't have to live in fear anymore. Call 800-346-6829. Learn how I can help you eliminate wage and bank levies, release tax liens, and negotiate a settlement with the IRS that will put your tax nightmare behind you forever. 
Call 800-34-NO-TAX or go to TaxHelpOnline.com. That's TaxHelpOnline.com. Join us in Joshua Tree, California, August 9th through 11th for the Contact in the Desert UFO Conference. A weekend of in-depth exploration into ancient aliens, human origins, crop circles, UFO sightings, and new evidence of ongoing contact. The conference will feature films, panels, lectures, workshops, and field work with leading experts including Stephen Greer, Giorgio Sukalas, Graham Hancock, Jim Mars, Michael Tellinger, Laura Eisenhower, Jason Martell, David Wilcock, Doc Wallace. David Serrata, and many, many more of the biggest names in UFOlogy. The conference will coincide with the Perseid Meteor Shell, and the Joshua Tree Retreat Center offers the perfect place for sightings through the clear desert sky. Enter to win a free ticket at contactinthedesert.com. We look forward to seeing you in Joshua Tree in August for a serious look at mounting evidence that we are not alone. For more information, go to contactinthedesert.com or call 760-365-8371. There are those curious about Bitcoins and those using and making money with Bitcoins. What are Bitcoins? A Bitcoin is the first decentralized currency that can be easily transferred from person to person over the Internet. No bank needed. This means lower fees and accounts can never be frozen, limited or closed. You are in control of your money. And the best part? You can start earning and making money with Bitcoins right away. No computer or expertise is required to earn money with Bitcoins, and a growing number of merchants now accept Bitcoins. Plus, they're easily exchanged for dollars, euros, and more. Learn more about the easiest, cheapest, most profitable way to enter the Bitcoin market and get paid every two weeks by one of the fastest-growing Bitcoin miners in the world at cloudhashing.com. Just like it sounds, cloudhashing.com. That's cloudhashing.com. We mine your business. Now available in soft cover and Kindle on Amazon is a revolutionary book that will forever change the way you look at health and diet. Dr. Brian Sturgeon's Body and Brain Diet. This amazing diet and exercise plan was developed when the surgeon himself was confronted with heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure, and cholesterol. There's no starving yourself and no calorie counting. You'll learn it's not how much you eat, but what you eat. Find easy-to-prepare recipes and simple step-by-step -step workout plans that exercise mind and body simultaneously. On the plan, Dr. Sturgeon lost over 70 pounds and reversed all the diseases naturally and with no medication. And many of his patients have had similar success. The body and brain diet allows you to naturally diminish or reverse diabetes, hypertension, coronary artery disease, skin tags, psoriasis, and more. A whole new outlook on life and a healthy future awaits you. And Dr. Brian Sturgeon's Body and Brain Diet, available in soft cover and Kindle on Amazon.com. Are you tired of searching for great talk radio? Something more important. Search no more. We are the GCN Radio Network. The Bright Side, 855-660-4261 is our number. If you've got questions about health, nutrition, prescription drugs, the longevity products, you want to get off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, 855-660-4261. Vitamin A, topically, let's see, there's so much more I want to tell you about here. Mm, if you do have acne, you do have zits, you do have blemishes, you've got to use retinoic acid or retinol, the uh, the uh, over-the-counter, the main over-the-counter form of vitamin A isn't going to work very effectively. That is retinyl palmitate. Remember, there's three kinds of vitamin A. You've got retinoic acid, which is the most active form, which is the active form of vitamin A. That's the kind that's used in chemotherapy. That's the kind that's, uh, uh, the, that cells respond to. That's the, basically, it's the active form. It's the stuff. The second form is kind of a middle form of vitamin A. It's got some activity, and that's retinol. You can use retinol topically, and you get some good effects with retinol topically, certain, certainly not like retinoic acid. But the protected form and the most common form of vitamin A, retinyl palmitate, is almost like a, 
It's a protected form. It's covered up with a palmitate. The retinal part, the vitamin A part, is protected with a, a fatty molecule. And that's what makes it so safe and so gentle. That's why you can take such high doses of retinal palmitate. But it also means it's not going to have a lot of effect. It's going to be maybe moisturizing, but it's not going to have a lot of effect for acne. So if you want to use topical vitamin A for your uh, pimples or for acne, or as we'll find out here uh, possibly tomorrow or the next day, what we can use it, uh, that you can use this stuff for wrinkles and photo damage as well. If you want to use vitamin A for your skin topically, you want to look for the retinoic acid form or you want to look for the retinol form. The retinoic acid form requires a prescription. It goes by the name Retin-A. Uh, you can get retinol over the counter, but you're typically not going to find a high enough dose of retinol. Most retinol-containing products are on the order of 0.1% retinol. You really need 1 to 5, even up to 10% retinol. So you're not going to get very much effect from most over-the-counter retinol-containing products. Retinol is also very, very unstable. So skincare, man uh, skincare product manufacturers don't really like working with retinol because of its instability. So if you want to use vitamin A topically for acne or for, as we'll talk about here in the next day or two, photoaging, look for retinoic acid. You need a prescription for it. You, uh, the generic form is just as good as the brand name Retin-A. Personally, I wouldn't be using the synthetic retinoids, which uh, go by the name Adapalene or Differin. Those are fake pharmaceutical versions. Uh, might as well get the real stuff, which is the retinoic acid. Okay, let's see. Tomorrow we'll talk about... Uh, how you can use vitamin A for photo damage, and we'll talk about how vitamin A really works. What's going on? Uh, how does vitamin A really work to help stabilize the growth of cells? It all has to do with a little tiny sliver, microscopic sliver of stuff around the order of 100,000 times thinner than the head of a pin, and this little tiny sliver of stuff where vitamin A works is really what's responsible for the formation of a, a plug, form actually is what's responsible for skin cells growing out of control, which ends up forming the plug. I'll tell you what I mean tomorrow as we continue talking about vitamin A and how it works for building, how it works for uh, helping take, keep the skin blemish-free, and how it works for reversing the effects of photo damage and tissue degradation or tissue breakdown. Okay, 855-660-4261, Brenda in OK, Oklahoma. What is going on? Welcome to the Bright Side. Hi. Um, uh, I'm calling. Um, I've had a previous years ago. Brenda, Brenda, we got something going on. I don't know what you're doing to your phone over there, Brenda. Speak up. I don't and... okay. You know what? I'm going to have to put you back on hold if I don't get you through. If I can't get... Brenda? I don't know what happened to Brenda. Okay, we're going to put Brenda back on hold here. I'm not sure what's going on with Brenda. Uh, Richard in Massachusetts, what's up? Hey, how you doing, uh, Ben? Uh, what's, I what's have, uh, I have, I've been diagnosed with heart failure a year ago, uh, April. Okay. They turned to give me a bag of um, medication here. They turned to give me satin drugs, which I rejected right from the beginning. All right. You want to deal with your heart failure drug-free? You want us to help you out? Because it's really easy to do. Yeah. Okay, there's a ton right. of things you could, ton of things you could do for the heart. First of all, recognize that when your heart breaks down, heart failure, cardiomyopathy, whatever you want to call it, this is not a primary health issue. This is a secondary health issue. That's the first most important thing about dealing with heart disease, which uh, next to cancer is uh, actually it is the leading cause of death in this country. Uh, the most important thing to recognize about heart failure, heart disease, cardiomyopathy, is it is secondary to thyroid problems, adrenal problems, and blood sugar problems, and ultimately at the very bottom to digestive problems. You cannot address heart disease without addressing the thyroid, without addressing the adrenal glands, which is your stress system, stress management system, without addressing blood sugar, and without addressing the digestive system. So number one, first and foremost, let's deal with the adrenal glands and the thyroid. You've got to figure out what's going on in your body that's creating this stress. Now, firstly, you can one of the easiest places to work with the adrenal glands and the thyroid, and they're connected, is by using mental and psychological and emotional techniques. This is very, very, very important. There's a lot of books out now about the emotional link to heart disease. One book is called Heart Math, which you might want to get, and the other one is called, uh, 
you know what? I forgot the name of the other one. But get Heart Math, and I'll tell you when we come back from our break. I'll tell you what the what the next uh, what the other book is. Uh, the Heart Math Institute is a uh, is a think tank, if you will, a research institute in California where they do a lot of research on the emotional connection to heart disease. Now, they don't tell you that this emotional link is related to the adrenal glands and the thyroid. I'm telling you that. When you're uh, freaking out about life, about anything going on, your adrenal glands will, will perceive that as some kind of stressor. That will slow down over time. That will slow down the thyroid, and that will suppress. Uh, that will slow down nutrition, uh, uh, the nutrition that gets to heart cells. It will slow down the heart. It will slow down the circulatory system. So first and foremost, you've got to figure out relaxation techniques. The best thing is deep breathing. Deep breathing. When you go into shallow breathing, the circulatory system shuts down or uh, tightens up. This reduces the flow of blood to the heart. This reduces oxygenation to the heart. This reduces nutrition to the heart. What you want to do is you want to figure out how to vasodilate, how to increase blood flow to the heart. Deep breathing is one of the most powerful techniques for doing that. So first and foremost, Richard, and this is so easy, it's drug-free, it's non-toxic, and it will help every system in the body. Sit down, get yourself a bio uh, If you have an iPhone or an Android phone, get yourself an app that, does, uh, that uh, has breathing on it. I like the bio-breathing app, and practice deep breathing techniques. That's first thing. First thing, before you do any, any, any cardiologist doesn't tell you that, I don't know what the heck these guys are thinking, drugging you with, a, like you say, a bag of prescription drugs when there's these non-toxic techniques that you can use. Secondly, there's great nutrition that you can use for the adrenal glands. Zinc is very, very important. It's also important for the heart, 50 milligrams a day of zinc. Vitamin C may be the single most important heart nutrient there is, also important for the adrenal glands. And this is kind of interesting. Nutrients that work for the adrenal glands also work for the heart. Uh, uh, I'd be doing anywhere from 5,000 to 10,000 milligrams of vitamin C a day. Look for powdered vitamin C, put it in water, and drink it. Vitamin E, stupendously important for all cardiovascular health issues, 400 IU a day, and its cousin, coenzyme Q10, 100 to 200 milligrams of coenzyme Q10 a day. Make sure you're using the oil-soluble version of CoQ10. Go ahead, buddy. I'm going to healthy start pack. I've been in the Healthy Start Pack. The Healthy Start them. Pack is great. You need the Healthy Start Pack, but I'm giving you stuff that's way above and beyond the Healthy Start Pack. Healthy Start Pack is, that's the basics. You guys, the Healthy Start Pack is the minimum wage. If you're happy working for minimum wage, then stay on the Healthy Start Pack. You need minimum wage to live. Okay, but if you're, health, if you're happy with minimum wage, the Healthy Start Pack's great. But if you want more, if you want to have more nutrition, more abundance in nutrition, you need all these other things. Hang tight, Richard. We'll finish up and come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben, 855-660-4261 is our number. We'll be back after this. There's a guy named Dr. Wallach who is anything but your typical doctor. Both a veterinarian and a naturopathic physician, Doc asks, why is this country spending more money on health care, by far, and ranking 50th in health and longevity worldwide? Doc believes that people should empower themselves with a basic understanding of nutrition, taking charge of their life, and obtaining optimal health and longevity through nutrition, not by toxic pharmaceutical drugs that lead to side effects that require more expensive and toxic pharmaceutical drugs. Talk about being dependent on drug companies to our own destruction, no less. This is clearly a deadly recipe. Doc Wallach's message is resonating with an increasing number of Americans who are waking up to all the government and big pharma manipulation of our health and health care system. I like what Doc Wallach is saying and doing to enlighten people about health care, and I've joined forces with him to help this tireless crusader spread his message. Visit BrightSideBend.com and listen to Doc Wallach's deadly recipe lectures. It makes a lot of sense, and I invite you to join our Brightside Ben team. Go to BrightSideBend.com. That's www.BrightSideBend.com. Introducing the only portable solar generator in the world that uses advanced sun tracking technology. The SunSocket Solar Generator from Aspect Solar, featuring 60-watt rotating solar panels, a built-in 250-watt-hour lightweight lithium-iron battery that charges in only five hours, multiple output sockets, and more. See it in action at AspectSolar.com or call 877-717-7778. Call 877-717-7778. Ceramic Body Armor is rated to stop six hits. But what about the seventh? Unlike ceramic or Kevlar, Infidel Body Armor is proven to take hit after hit, and it just won't quit. Reasonably priced and designed for the smart civilian prepper, Infidel stops hundreds of hits from small arms to high-powered rifles. That means safety and peace of mind. Buy yours at InfidelBodyArmor.com. Spelled I-N-F-I-D-E-L BodyArmor.com. Infidel Body Armor just won't quit. 
Attention, citizens of northern Arizona. Are you prepared? If not, now's your chance to get prepared at the Arizona Survivalist Prepper Expo. August 24th from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. at Tim's Toyota Center in Prescott Valley. Visit with Arizona-based and national suppliers of such items as freeze-dried foods, solar ovens, solar equipment, tactical gear, camping gear, water filtration supplies, and much more. Do you need a bug-out bag? Do you need to stock up on freeze-dried food? Are you curious what a solar oven is? Take a tour of the ultimate bunker, a portable above or below ground survival shelter. Visit with Doomsday Prepper stars from around Arizona, such as Tim Ralston of Gear Up and Brian Moffat of Extreme Defense USA. Informative speakers will be providing valuable insight every hour on such topics as long-term food storage and emergency first aid skills. Bring your family, bring your friends, bring your neighbors. We won't rest until every citizen in Arizona is prepared. Visit our website, ArizonaSurvivalistShows.com. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document? Worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average over 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE. 855-340-7283. The GCN Radio Network, providing the world with hard-hitting talk radio. G-C-N. Great talk radio starts here. All right, we're back on the bright side. I am Pharmacist Ben. We're talking to uh, Richard in Massachusetts. Uh, Richard, you there, bro? Richard? I'm here. Okay, Richard. Yeah, the Healthy Star Pack is wonderful. Uh, you know, that's the bare bones minimum. Everybody needs the Healthy Star Pack. That's the 90 essential nutrients. But once you're dealing with heart failure or any kind of health issue, then you've got to start to really pound the nutrition, in my opinion anyway, you've got to start really pounding in the nutrition and the nutritional supplements. Not just supplements. There's also some food things. I'll tell you that, about that in a minute. So, anyway, vitamin C, zinc, vitamin E, coenzyme Q10, magnesium, stupendously important for the heart. Get on the OsteoMag if you want to use the Longevity products, uh, 1,200 milligrams of magnesium a day. Make sure you're getting some extra potassium. Potassium can be taken in supplemental form or it can be taken in vegetable juice form. Vegetables are, the, are your best food sources of potassium. Uh, the, the next most important thing, in, oh, and one other nutrient for heart failure is carnitine. It uh, can be very helpful. You might want to get the book, The Sinatra Solution, uh, Dr. Stephen Sinatra talks a lot about all these nutrients, and he talks a lot about nutritional supplementation for, uh, for dealing with heart failure. Uh, and then the B vitamins are also important for the heart, especially thiamine and niacin, vitamin B1 and B3, which takes me to the second most important strategy in addition to all of these supplements for dealing with the heart, and that is keeping your blood sugar under control, stabilizing insulin, staying away from any foods that spike your insulin. This is so important. Insulin resistance and diabetes and heart failure go hand in hand. They are almost like the same syndrome, the same part of the same disease process. Any cardiovascular health issue should be regarded as an insulin and blood sugar issue as well. That means, number one, staying off of foods that spike blood sugar, and you know the drill, you know the usual suspects, bread, pasta, cereal, fruit juice, desserts, uh, um, any, any kind of refined carbohydrates, and, as, and fructose, fruit, uh, fruit sugar can also be a problem as well. Staying away from those kinds of foods. Once you're into heart failure, you really have to have zero tolerance for any of these foods as best as you can. And then using nutrients that help stabilize blood sugar. The sweeties from longevity, chromium, vanadium. Magnesium is great for your heart. It will also help stabilize your blood sugar. Vitamins B1 and B3, thiamine and niacin, they're great for your heart. They'll also stabilize your blood sugar. Zinc and vitamin C, very important for the heart. They'll also stabilize your blood sugar. We've been talking about vitamin A now for the, uh, for the last couple of weeks. Vitamin A is very important for the heart. And vitamin A will also help stabilize your blood sugar. So you've got lots of nutrients 
the heart, you got lots of nutrients for the blood sugar, then you got to go into the digestive system. Once your gallbladder and your liver become compromised, heart disease will follow. Uh, 30% of Americans are dealing with, fa with fatty liver disease. You're probably one of them, Richard. The odds are pretty good, especially if you're dealing with heart, with heart failure. That means you want to focus on fatty, uh, uh, processing fatty foods, using digestive enzymes, using pancreatin, getting on bile salts, using lecithin. Make sure you're taking fatty nutrients, that is your fatty vitamins, vitamins A, D, E, K, and please don't forget about those all-important essential fatty acids. If you're on the Healthy Start Pack, you'll get the ultimate EFAs, uh, and the ultimate EFAs are great, but you're going to need to take about 9 or 12 a day. Make sure you take them with fatty foods, with all of your digestive support, the, uh, the bile salts, the pancreatin, the ultimate enzymes. Uh, and by the way, the ultimate enzymes are also good for cardiovascular health. If you take them on an empty stomach, they'll help thin your blood, get more blood to your, uh, get more blood to your heart, more nourishment, more detoxification, and more oxygenation. If you're not getting oxygen to the heart, you will have heart failure. And all these nutrients that we just told you about, in addition to the breathing techniques and the relaxation techniques, will increase perfusion, blood supply to the heart, improve oxygenation, improve nutri nutritional del nutrition delivery, as well as detoxification. There's a ton of things you could do. Pills. What's that? What about these pills? What, you know, I can't tell you. If you're under the care of a doctor, I can't tell you what to do with the pills. But I can tell you what I would do with the pills, and that's flush them down the darn toilet. That's what I would do. Now, I'm not telling you what to do because you're under the care of a physician, and it's not fair for me to go crosswise with what he's telling you to do. I don't want to do that. As long as he's taking care of you, you're in his care. Now, as long as you're in his care, you've got to deal with him, and I can't sit there and interfere. If you're not in his care, uh, I'll tell you, personally, I'd be flushing him down the toilet. That's me. That's not you. You understand what I'm saying? It's not fair for me that's to interfere what? with his work. What's that? That's what I want to hear. I okay, think well, that's just me. That's just me. I'm, I'm telling you, it's not fair for me to interfere with what that doctor's doing with your relationship that you have with him, and I'm not going to do that. But if it's me, I, I don't go near me. those. I'm telling you, you know what, Richard, when I'm dispensing, and I don't do it anymore, but when I was dispensing pills in the pharmacy, I didn't even want to breathe that nasty stuff. I, didn't, I would turn my head away if it, was a, if it was a tablet and had dust in it. I would turn my head away so I wouldn't have to breathe the stuff, let alone take it. That stuff is awful, 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 toxic, nasty, poison. It's the, how a, a medical professional can dispense that in the name of health care is so beyond me. But once you've committed to having a relationship with that doctor, that's between you and him, and it's not fair for me to interfere. All right, man, i got to move on. Does that help you, bro? That's coming to an end shortly. Okay, well, good luck. God bless. If you want to shoot me an email, I'll give you some more advice. Thanks so much, buddy. Ben at KSCO.com. You guys, if you have heart failure, if you have a heart condition, there's so many things you can do. I just spent five minutes with this guy. I must have, we must have given him 10 or 15 or 20 different strategies that he can use to improve his heart. This is what a doctor should be doing, in my opinion, not dispensing drugs. Now his body has a further burden. Now his adrenal glands have more stress. Now his liver has more work to do. This is what happens when you take prescription drugs. You think you just take them and they just magically fix your heart? That's not how it works. They get processed as poisons and now you have a weakened bo a body that's already weakened is now further weakened by being poisoned. And yes, your body can process the poison, but do you really want to give your body that much work to do when it's already compromised? This is the, the, the stupidity of the pharmacomedical model. It is pure stupidity or even worse, it's predatory, and it's not fair. It's just not right, and that's why I do this program, and that's why I do my presentations, and that's why I do what I do. It's not fair. All right, Brendan, Oklahoma, see if we can get you back here. What's yeah. going on, girl? Well, uh, I've been having some problems with my lower abdomen, like down there where the bladder is. I've, uh, last night I was up all night long. I uh, have to go to the bathroom. Um, did you like actually have bathroom. Did you actually urinate? Or did you a feel little like bit, a little? Okay, a you little felt bit, an urge. Much. You felt like the, yes. Okay, uh, it sounds like you got a urinary tract infection. Have you ever had that before? Yeah, I've had one where it was really bad before. Okay, <laughs> it sounds like that's what's happening. A urinary tract infection is caused by bacteria in the urinary tract that don't belong there. There's several reasons why that can happen. 
but most importantly, what you're dealing with is a compromised immune system. That's the first thing that you want to focus on. Now, if you have urinary tract infections that happen somewhat frequently, you must have something else going on. Urinary tract infections, like with Richard, I was talking about his heart, how that's secondary to other factors. If you have chronic urinary tract infections, chances are you've got something going on in the immune system. It's not doing its work. Your immune system should be taking care of the bacteria that's causing the urinary tract infection. So first, if you want to just take care of it symptomatically, a couple, a couple of things you could do. Uh, get yourself some mannose, M-A-N-N-O-S-E. Put a couple teaspoons in water, drink it down, mannose powder. Uh, that can help slip, slide the uh, bacteria out of the urinary tract. Uh, you can also use the Z-Radical product as the same thing. It kind of slimes the bacteria off of the cells in the urinary tract, so you excrete those bacteria. Uh, also, Lugol solution, that's spelled L-U-G-O-L-S. Lugol solution, uh, that's an iodine solution that can kill the bacteria in the urinary tract, so that's another thing you might want to try. Uh, vitamin C sometimes helps. High doses of vitamin C, you might want to try that. Uh, and then what I'd be doing is I'd be focusing on why is your immune system compromised, and almost always you're going to see that you have some kind of digestive health issue. Do you have a history of digestive problems, anything like that, constipation, diarrhea yeah. that you know of? Oh, sometimes I get constipation, sometimes I really don't. Oh, okay, I so stop right there. I stop right there. If it's sometimes, then it's more than sometimes, because you're noticing it sometimes, but it's more than that. So that's a very important piece of information. You want to focus on the foods that you're eating before you have the constipation, before you have the diarrhea. Uh, because all of those are, tell, are, are going to put a stress on the immune system that's going to divert it from being able to take, you know, being able to handle the bacteria that are causing the urinary tract infection. It's going to sort of divert its resources. So you want to uh, make sure that you're uh, digesting your food properly. Stay away from foods that cause the uh, diarrhea or the constipation, and get yourself on the nightly essence or a good probiotic supplement. That will do a couple of things for you. Number one, it will help stabilize any kind of digestive uh, issues that you have. It'll take care of your digestive problems. Number two, the probiotics will fight the, the good bacteria, will fight the bad bacteria, and that's how it works. That's one of the most important benefits of using the nightly essence or using probiotic supplements is they will fight off the bad bacteria. So get yourself on the nightly essence, correct digestive issues, get on the digestive enzymes, the ultimate enzymes, eliminate the problem foods, and if you want some symptomatic relief, Lugol solution, uh, Manos, M-A-N-N-O-S-E, uh, or the z Radical from Yongevity. Those can all be helpful. All right, that's all the time we have for today. Brent, if you like, you can shoot me an email, ben at ksco.com. Put your phone number in there, and I'll get back to you. We'll be back tomorrow. We'll talk more about vitamin A, how you can use it topically for photo damage, for taking care of wrinkles, and we'll finish up talking about how you can use it for taking care of acne as well. Check out my website, brightsideben.com or pharmacistben.com, and click on the Join the Team link. Start yourself a longevity business. Enjoy the tax benefits associated with having your own business. Uh, and that's all the time we have for today. We'll talk to you all tomorrow, folks. Bye for now. Are you still a traditional smoker? Now experience a new lifestyle and try vaping with e-cigarettes by LeSig. Imagine no ashes, stains, nasty smell, or coughing and hacking. With LeSig e-cigarettes revolutionary microelectronic technology, rechargeable battery, and unique replaceable cartridge, you'll get all the benefits and satisfaction of smoking without the hazards. Choose your taste from a wide variety of our new American-made vaporeate e-liquids at LeSig.com. And LeSig smokes the competition by serving thousands of worldwide customers with real people customer service, fast, free, same-day shipping, and a 30-day warranty and satisfaction guarantee. So are you ready for a new vaping lifestyle? Then call 870-518-4307. That's 870-518-4307. Or visit LeSig.com, spelled L-E-C-I-G.com. LeSig e-cigarettes for today's modern smoker. Time and time again. You need to come here and help us. We need assistance. Please. Those we should be able to depend on let us down. Federal and state and local officials saying help is on the way. Will the folks here in Bell Harbor say show me? Don't.
depend on the government to save you. Take action now so that you're prepared for the next disaster with MyPatriotSupply.com. Get the best prices on storable food, non-GMO seeds, water filtration devices, home canning equipment, survival and self-reliance books, and more at MyPatriotSupply.com. Call 866-229-0927. We are hurting down here, and we need help immediately. Before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotSupply.com. MyPatriotSupply.com. 